The first thing I want to start up, this is a terrific film, and these are great characters. I figure it must be kind of easy getting into a character like this in that kind of environment. I mean, it looked freezing where you guys were. Yeah. Did that help a lot? I think the elements are always really helpful instead of like fighting against them. Um, I think it would be a little, it was frustrating sometimes when we had to use fake snow, but. You're right, yeah. Um, but yeah, it, it is helpful. I wouldn't say that that makes it easy to get into to do anything, but it, it makes your job easier that you already have, like, a, you already have the, what's it called? Something that you're going against. I'm learning Obstacle. words today. Obstacles. You already have the <laughs> obstacles there for you, and you don't have to create them. I can imagine. Yeah. How much did you know about tracking and, the, and what this guy does? Did you, how much did you have to learn? I, you know, I, I feel like there was uh, not a lot that I had to to jump into on that. It was, it was, it was much more, about um, dealing with the, um, the emotional sort of uh, story of, and the internal story of, of him. That was the, the most focus, the most energy I put towards, towards the, the picture was, was that journey. I can't even imagine the emotional stakes that this character is going through. Well, it, it was just tricky, you know. I always thought that it would, it would have been, um, that he was much more stoic than I, than I anticipated and, and then and I realized that he just wasn't because of certain, every time there's a situation that would come up, it's like I'd have to really, really fight to hold things back, which is great. Um, but there was, it was really wonderful challenges to, to kind of navigate the, um, the delicate nature of, of the emotional journey. With you, have you ever been in that position where you feel like kind of like everyone's against you? Because this is, it's such a great role. Have I ever been? I've never been in any kind of uh, position of life or death or any anything like that before. Um, I have dreams about it all the time. Mm. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, just I mean, just the way she's treated too. Yeah. It's I mean, technically. Yeah, I mean, technically, I mean, technically, it's it's uh, it's not that crazy to imagine myself as being the only female in a room full of dominant men. That's like being on a movie set. Um, but I, what was the challenge was trying to understand why, why, why does someone want to become a federal agent? Why does someone decide to put themselves in that position, especially a woman? Is it because something was done wrong to them or is it just because they believe in morality and justice and trying to figure out how I can legitimately seem like I can hold my own as a federal agent with all these other men who are very aggressive and holding guns and feeling like I can assert authority, that was an intimidating idea because that's, I, I am someone who would rather just kind of be quiet and like go into and like blend into a wall. But um, to, but to find that was really interesting and to try and to just yeah, to find that kind of like inner strength or put yourself in a situation where you, yeah, you have to. You got very to. A-type. You got very, mm -hmm. yeah, you got very aggressive. Mm-hmm. You're very aggressive. I'm aggressive? <laughs> <laughs> I'm aggressive. I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> I'm aggressive. <laughs> what are That's you what talking about? <laughs> 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 no, yeah, you, you, yeah it was so, that was very far from you, that, that character. And you got to do a think good, I good job with that. Yeah, I mean, I, I think. That strength. Yeah, I think you, you, thanks, Jeremy. I don't know, but um, that was, that's like something that I can't, I can't actually imagine doing. That was, a, that was a day on set that I was.